I want to take a moment to share my gratitude and my appreciation for everyone in the Stanford community in these extraordinary times. In the past few weeks, we've provided you with a lot of written information on the coronavirus, but I also wanted to speak to you directly. Our world is facing a challenge of enormous magnitude with the spread of the virus. As you know, at Stanford, we've taken a series of escalating steps to respond to the threat. We recognize just how disruptive and very difficult this has been for everyone. We've all been asked to make unprecedented sacrifices to ensure social distancing to help slow and reduce the spread of the virus. This is especially important to help protect the most vulnerable members of our campus community and our surrounding community. The difficulty has been taken to a new level with the announcement of the shelter-in-place policy in the Bay Area. But as challenging as this has all been, I'm so heartened by what I've seen and heard from you. In this time of incredibly rapid change, people have been responding with understanding, with resilience, and by showing genuine compassion for each other. Whether you're caring for patients, moving home from dorms, feeding our students or cleaning our facilities, redesigning courses to go online, or in the case of our alumni, opening your doors to students who can't go home, you've inspired us with your strength, your resolve, and your empathy. I know you have many questions about where we go from here. As the situation continues to evolve rapidly, I want to assure you, we will be pushing hard to make thoughtful, informed decisions and will continue to consult and communicate with you as directly as possible. I want to close by expressing my thanks to all of you, to the teams of people who are working tirelessly to respond to the situation, to those of you who have shared your ideas and suggestions on the path forward, and especially to all of you who are helping to advance the well-being of our community in the face of your own difficult personal challenges. No matter where we each find ourselves at this moment, we are still a community. And I want to reassure you, by standing together, we will get through as a community. I deeply appreciate everything you're doing. We'll continue to be in touch. Thank you so much.